The film begins with Natalie, a 22-year-old about to graduate from the University of Texas, who is struggling to juggle motherhood in her career. She loved Arden's lot to graduate and travel to Los Angeles to impress her bosses with her drawings by shooting animated films. The story begins with Natalie studying with her boyfriend Davis. She helps him study. He invites her for a drink. In celebration of his band getting a benefactor, she is happy with this and embraces him. He tells her that she does not need to worry because their plan is coming true as they loved each other so much a few days later. A prom Natalie is throwing up her friend Jared gets worried about her and then comes to her Aiden brings her a pregnancy test at that time the story splits into two parallel realities there is Natalie who tested negative and Natalie who tested positive Natalie who is not pregnant is happy and completes the party while the pregnant Natalie is unhappy and thinks about her future then she takes Gabe out of the party to tell him about it at first see his word worried but he supports and encourages her she tells her friend that this will stop her dream so she tells her that she should not travel but she refuses insisting on achieving her dream. The non-pregnant Natalie is excited about the new part of her life and leaves college with her friend for Los Angeles while the other Natalie still heartbroken leaves college to tell her parents about the pregnancy they get upset about it and negatively judge being a gigolo. They argue when her parents go out onto the balcony, and Gabe proposes marriage to her, but she declines the other Natalie arrives in Los Angeles very happy. Then she starts looking for a job, and sees an advertisement for Lucy Galloway, who's looking for an assistant painter pregnant. Natalie wakes up in a room to the noise of her parents, who have turned her room into a gem, they tell her to apply for a job and remind her about doctor's appointments. Natalie, who is not pregnant can't find a job, and learns that Lucy Galloway has thrown a party, so her friend urges her to come at the party she meets Jake, and she tells him she wants to meet Lucy she looks for her but can't find her, so Jake tells her to stay for a while. The other Natalie was in the kitchen talking to her friend Kara on the phone who was telling her about life in Los Angeles, and she felt sad and started crying about what happened with her life Natalie is in Los Angeles on a call to interview for a job, as Lucy's assistant, she went to the interview, and while she was nervously waiting with other candidates Jake arrived to help her, she was surprised to see him so he told her that he works here. She starts the interview, and she tells Lucy how much she likes her. Lucy looked at her drawings and liked them, so she decided to hire her but not as her assistant while in Texas. Natalie is on an obstetrician's appointment with Gabe. They find out that she is pregnant with a girl. The other Natalie was with Jake who encouraged her to get a job and they told her you wanted to be a documentary filmmaker and he had a five-year plan like her Natalie and Gabe were reading a book about parenting. Suddenly she was about to give birth and her parents arrived. She gave birth to a baby girl and named her Rosie. It was Jake's birthday, and they both had a lot of work to do and they had to draw the code at this point. She begins to feel in love with Jake meanwhile Natalie and Gabe deal with the baby and all the crying and diapers, and she was sad to see pictures of her successful friend, and she gets very upset while her mom tries to support her. She changes her hairdo while Gabe gives her compliments six months later. They all celebrated half a year since the birth of the baby girl in Los Angeles. Natalie tries to submit her drawings, but Lucy ignores her. She meets Jake and tells him about what happened, and he tells her that you got a simple job and is going to be nominated to become a director, so she encourages him later. Jake and Natalie go out to eat and talk and confess their crush on each other a few days later, Tara returns home and finds Jake and Natalie, who introduces her to him while in Texas. Natalie arrives at Gabe's apartments to congratulate him on his achievement, and he kisses her. She turns away from him, she offers her that she and Rosie come to live with him, but she refuses being afraid that the relationship will fail, and that this will affect Rosie so she asks him to look for someone else, so he accepts her decision. Cher arrives and visits Natalie and Rosie, they talk about everything in gay several years later when Rosie was four years old, Natalie had some time to devote her drawings while in Los Angeles, Natalie is still happily in her relationship with Jake, as she has watched him succeed as a director one day Natalie was with her family at a barbecue suddenly Miranda, Gabe's friend appeared, and Natalie became jealous of her, and asked Ye to leave Miranda, but he told her that she was part of his life, and because of her rejection of him Miranda became close to him, so Natalie faked a smile to hide her sadness, Natalie was in LA with Jake when Kara and her neighbor walked in and they were so happy for her while Natalie had something she drew and wanted to show it to Jake who was amazed by her John Byings, and advised her to be so bold as to show these drawings to Lucy she dares, and shows her drawing to Lucy who accepts seeing them that night Natalie was with Jake, 
and she was complaining about Lucy's late answer and they were talking about apartments they could move into but Jake wasn't listening and was acting weird and looking worried. Then he told her there was a project in Nova Scotia and he had to be there for six months to a year. She asked him if they would live together and he replied that she could move in with him but he wouldn't always be there. She reassures him and says everything will be fine between them. Natalie in Texas decides to visit Kara in Los Angeles. So she leaves Rosie with Gabe so she can have fun for a week. She was so excited to go to La and meet up with her friend and go out together at the restaurant. She bumps into Jake who is carrying juice and accidentally spills in on her. She apologizes and buys her some drinks as a way of apologizing. Carrie tells Natalie that she can't live in LA because it's so crowded but she laughs and says maybe Rosie should be with her. Natalie, Los Angeles is dressed as she searches for an apartment for herself and Jake, especially due to his lack of communication and the time difference. She is still at Kara's house when she gets a call from Rosie who misses her asking her about Jeep and she says he is left and left her with a babysitter. She gets upset and calls him immediately but he doesn't answer. Kiara arrives and asks her if she wants to go to a beach, but she says she has to go back. She asks her what happened and she tells her that Gabe is not answering her calls. And has left Rosie with a stranger. Kiara gets upset but she understands Natalie packed up and left. Natalie was in Los Angeles working when Lucy asked her to come to her office to talk. She tells her that she is very talented, but she lacks something in her drawings, so she fires her. She calls Jay crying to tell him what happened so he can try to comfort her. But things don't work out and she feels detached from the relationship she's been striving to maintain as Jake doesn't care. He tries to justify himself but she asks for supper operation and he agreed she is now unemployed and without a partner she cries what happened to her. While Natalie is in Texas, she comes to Gabe's house and takes her daughter and argues with him for leaving the girl with a stranger. He is disappointed that she left her vacation so he tells her that he loved the girl with Miranda's sister because he went out with her to propose to her. She is surprised. And when she leaves she cries because the person she loves will marry another woman because of her. Natalie arrives from Los Angeles at her parents' house to seek comfort in Texas. She was very sad because all those around her had established their lives including children marriage and a good job. She decides to accompany Care to a co-worker's baby shower where she feels useless. She argues with Kara and leaves the party furious not only from Texas has been painting with Kara comes to visit she apologizes for the way she acted in Los Angeles, but Kara was very understanding and supported her decision to focus on your daughter in her career, not gay at the same time they were both devoting their time to painting and focusing on their creativity. They both work from their home in Texas and decided to post the cartoons on the internet. On Rosie's first day at school, Natalie meets Miranda and Gabe as she hands them some gifts to give to Rosie. Suddenly she receives a call from Kara who informs her that her animated short film has been nominated as one of the best films in the competition. Meanwhile, Natalie was in Los Angeles watching TV with Kara and received a notification that her short film had been selected for a famous festival. So they both jumped joyfully at the news she met Gabe while their daughter was attending school. She tells them that she has a surprise, and she tells him about the bully so he hugs her, and tells her that his band will be performing at the same festival. She tries to call Jake to tell him about the festival but he doesn't answer so she leaves him a message they attended the festival, and Natalie from Texas was talking about her daughter who inspired her to draw for films. While the other Natalie was Karen met Gabe after five years, and hugged him they sat down, and he told her he was married and would have a baby. While she told them about the negative pregnancy result that day, everyone congratulates Gabe on the offer, and she is surprised Miranda is in there, so he tells her they broke up and he tells her she doesn't look like her Jake is out looking for a ticket to get in, he meets Natalie and they hug, and then they watch the animated movie and notice Lucy who congratulates her and offers her a job in Los Angeles. Natalie and Gabe were walking around and talking, she apologized for keeping him away from her. He smiled and kissed her the other, Natalie and Jake were not stored to the house where the party was held years ago. She asked him to wait for her, the other Natalie walked by with Gabe, and she asked him to wait for her too, they walked into the bathroom, and remembered the moment that changed their lives and said everything was fine, they had achieved their goals. If you want interesting movie recaps like, share and subscribe to follow us for more movie recaps.